Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So in previous video, I explained introduction to function. In today's video, I'll be explaining syntax of a function. So let us start the video. So syntax of a function is nothing but it consists of return type, name of function, parameters. Return type is nothing but the output type. Name of function can be anything. In this case, I am taking my function name as sample. Parameters are nothing but the input to the function. As I said, function is nothing but a block of code. So, here in body of the function, logic can be written. Like sum of two numbers, palindrome logic, whatever logic you want to perform. After performing the specific task, you will get something as output here. So this output should be returned, right? So this is the output type that to be returned from this function. In this, we have function declaration, function definition, function call. Let us understand function declaration. Function declaration consists of return type function name parameters let us understand it by taking one simple example so in my case i took int sample int a comma int b so this is nothing but the return type or output this is function name this a and b are parameters and input to the function Let us take one more example. In sample int comma int. So here int is return type. Sample is function name. These are parameters. So here if you can see I didn't write a comma b. This is also correct. If you write declaration of a function in this type. It is also valid. Both are valid. So, now we will discuss what is the purpose of declaration. A function declaration tells the compiler that there is a function with the given name defined somewhere else in the program. So, what it means? So, it tells the compiler or instructs the compiler that there is a function with the given name. In our case, function name is sample. So, declaration will say the compiler that there is a function in our code in our program somewhere else uh, with the given name defined somewhere else in the program it means that in our program or code there is a function whose definition is written somewhere else in the program so how to write definition function definition so second we have function definition it is nothing but actual function it consists the block of code that performs some specific task that is addition of two numbers so as we said function task is to perform some specific task so this is our actual function so it consists of the block of code okay let us understand here we have return type function name parameters as you can see here we don't have semicolon but in the declaration part we had semicolon so here we have return type function name parameters same as function declaration but we don't have semicolon and we have here body of function where logic is performed and we have a return statement so here return type is nothing but output type like int float function name can be anything parameters are input to the function so on on this input 
द लॉजिक इज परफॉर्म्ड और ऑपरेशन इज परफॉर्म सम स्पेसिफिक ऑपरेशन इज परफॉर्म ऑन दिस इनपुट एंड आफ्टर परफॉर्मिंग द ऑपरेशन द आउटपुट इज रिटर्न फ्रॉम द फंक्शन एंड दैट आउटपुट टाइप रिटर्न आउटपुट टाइप इज डिस्प्लेड हियर लाइक वॉट इज द टाइप ऑफ आउटपुट इंट और फ्लोट एनीथिंग ओके नाउ लेट अस अंडरस्टैंड बाय टेकिंग वन मोर एग्जाम्पल सो एज हियर वी हैव रिटर्न टाइप फंक्शन नेम पैरामीटर्स इंट सैम्पल वाइड इंट इज अवर रिटर्न टाइप आउटपुट रिटर्न टाइप सैम्पल इज फंक्शन नेम वाइड इज अवर इनपुट पैरामीटर सो इन द अपकमिंग वीडियो विल बी डिस्कसिंग हियर वाइड मीन्स नो पैरामीटर्स और नो इनपुट सो वी विल बी हैविंग फंक्शन विद पैरामीटर विदउट पैरामीटर विथ रिटर्न टाइप विदउट रिटर्न टाइप ओके सो इन दिस नाउ जस्ट अंडरस्टैंड दैट वाइड मीन्स नो पैरामीटर्स नो इनपुट टू द फंक्शन सो दिस इज दिस इज अ फंक्शन डेफिनेशन दिस होल इज कॉल फंक्शन डेफिनेशन this is header this is body where block of code is written and we have a return expression here our return type return type output is of integer type so output is integer type input there is no input so this was function definition now function call a function call is a statement that instructs the compiler to execute the function so what it means now suppose we wrote a function in our program or code but how this will execute so in our function there will be a function call which instructs or tells the compiler that in our program there is a function which is to be executed okay suppose in our program or code we have 10 functions so we have to instruct the compiler that in our program there are 10 functions of different logics okay and that to be executed we'll discuss function call in working of the function so so for now just understand that a function call is a statement that instructs the compiler to execute the function for executing a function we have function call right so i hope you find this video useful so in the upcoming video we'll be discussing working of a function so stay tuned bye